Hi guys! It's like 5 in the morning and we are getting picked up in 30 minutes. Just wanted to show you guys. You've already seen what I'm going to be wearing on the plane. But I just wore, I'm wearing super, super light makeup. I've got like my Bare Minerals Powder Foundation. Very light eyeshadow. Lots of lip balm. Um, and yeah, just keeping it simple, stupid. And a tip for if you're going out traveling, make your bed so that when you come back, it looks perfect and inviting. And actually just clean your entire home, which is what we did. So I'm, it like makes you more excited to come home because you don't have to worry about cleaning anything. So travel tip of the 5 a.m. I have not had any coffee yet and I really need coffee, but we're gonna have to wait till we get to the airport. Ah! Anyway, keeping you updated, day one. Okay guys, we are finally in the rental car and we are so tired. It's like 9.30 Eastern Standard Time right now and 3.30 local time. We have been awake since 4.30 Eastern Standard Time. So we're pretty exhausted, but we're so excited to be here. Here we are. We're entering the room. And they gave us a lay. We got laid. <laughs> Here it is, it's so gorgeous. Oh my god, Gage is so tired. Here it is. And the poolside garden view. Boom a chakalaka. We are so lucky. I love Ooh. you. I'm so excited. And I just can't hide it. I'm so excited to sleep. Hey guys, so we just you know, got some lunch, and this is what I wore. I wore my high-waisted little red shorts with these this cute little lace. Ska, 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 what is it? Ska, ska, scalloping. Oh my god, that was too difficult to say. And this little dark gray crop top, and my turquoise necklace. And I had a big island iced tea and a veggie burger, so that was good. Um, yeah. First meal here, I'm so happy. Nice and full and slightly toasted, but that's nice because I'm of legal age. Anyway, we're probably going to call it an early night because we're so done. Hey guys, uh, we just woke up about an hour ago. Um, it's 6.30 a.m local time but it feels like noon <laughs> to us so sorry that I look like a hot mess right now I haven't really done anything to myself but check out these gorgeous robes oh my gosh they're so soft on the inside they're not as soft as three years ago when we were here last but they're still so soft Arr! so we're just trying to figure out what we're gonna do with our day now that we're up like crazy early so We'll keep you updated. All right, guys, so we fueled up with coffee and breakfast at Starbucks and went to Safeway to get some groceries because we need to save some money, not spend $100 per meal at the resort. Um, and speaking of fuel, we are filling up the gas tank of the rental car and gonna be heading back to the resort to go to the beach. <sighs> best day ever. No, tomorrow's gonna be the best day ever. We just got back from spending a couple of hours at the beach laying out and I was reading Beautiful Ruins and Gage went uh, snorkeling. He saw some fish. 
So that's cool. Um, and we had lunch on the beach. That was my computer. <laughs> uh, I had a turkey wrap and a fruit cup. And the cool thing about this place is actually come and take your order while you're on the beach so you don't have to get up and they serve you. So fancy place this is. And then we spent some time in the adults only spa area. Like it's kind of like a hot tub, but not like super crazy hot and it was really relaxing and it overlooks the beach and I just it's amazing so that was really cool and we're definitely gonna go back to that area because it closes at 10 and it seems like a great place to watch the sunset guys we are ready and about to walk over to Lani Vai which is the spa and we're gonna get our couples massage and hang out in the hydrotherapy garden and it's gonna be so amazing this is the day that we have been waiting for whenever we thought about our vacation in Hawaii we thought about this day so we are both really excited about this massage at Lani Vai and interesting thing is we get there and somehow our appointment had been canceled like by some ghostly thing um, we booked it like two weeks ago and then it got canceled like literally the day before we left so we get there and they're like um you don't have an appointment but we're gonna fix it and so they fixed it and we were able to do a same day uh, appointment but we ended up just hanging out in the hydrotherapy garden for like four hours and then we had our amazing massage oh it felt so good so and then which it was super nice um, they it was complimentary the whole thing was was free so that was kind of their saying hey we're really sorry that we something went wrong um, but Gage and I were both like well that's one way to to bring back a customer because we're like, hey, we just saved $300, but we had already set that money aside, so maybe we'll go back. <laughs> so anyway, so that's what happened there, and that's kind of what we did the whole day. We didn't go to the pool or anything. So and then we went to the Olelo room to have dinner, and our dinner was mostly appetizers. <laughs> uh, not super healthy appetizers, but appetizers. So that was our dinner, and I fell asleep really super crazy early because I had had a mojito and it made me sleepy. <laughs> Check out this monstrous Mai Tai in a pineapple. It's a mojito. Sorry, mojito, thank you. Check out this monstrous mojito in this pineapple. It is delicious. This pineapple is frozen, so it makes the drink stay cold. Isn't that amazing? Oh, it's so good. And here is me drinking it. around like right before 5 30 in the morning which I was very surprised I actually thought that I, it was later but I woke up and I'm like oh it's still dark outside <laughs> It was one of the best 
yoga classes I've ever taken. The instructor was very, very good. She was amazing. Her voice was very soothing and um, all of the positions and, and uh, poses that she chose were like my body was loving every single one. So that was really nice. And so the sun was kind of already up, but it was still behind the building. About halfway through, you could see the sun hitting the top of the rocks that were in the middle of the cove, and it was like super beautiful. It was, it was pretty incredible, so. Then, after that, Gage and I went to Vintage Island Coffee, which is right across the street from the resort, and I had a Hawaiian honey latte, and he just had some coffee. <laughs> And then we walked back. going to just tacos for dinner and this is what I'm wearing this is a little fringy crop top sort of thing that I got from I don't know where and the shorts I got from the same place that is unknown um, and I'm wearing my little turquoise necklace again and these little owl earrings that I know I got from Kohl's same with the shoes shoes are from Kohl's so yeah, I'm really excited. I feel like Mexican is going to make my belly really happy. So that's what we're doing. So dinner at Just Tacos was delicious. I got a steak burrito um, and it was really big and I couldn't finish it, but Gage finished it. He's such a champ, even though it had guacamole in it, which he hates, uh, but we didn't want it to go to waste. So anyway, now I think we're just gonna watch an episode of Orange is the New Black and go to sleep early because I've been awake since 5.30 a.m. so <sighs> anyway that's gonna be it for the first part of my vlog series of being on vacation in Hawaii so I hope you enjoy this video and I hope you're looking forward to what's gonna be coming next on my vacation. Bye! Thank you.